Hey guys, Tony Smith with Dennis and Yachty. Today we're on board the Fontaine Peugeot Samana 59. So we're gonna check it out. Let us know your thoughts and feedback. Okay, so stepping on board here, we've got the uh, hydraulic platform. So this is a high-low platform here that goes up and down. Um, in your main cockpit area, you'll see you get a huge table here. Pan across here. So entering the main salon here, what you'll see is you've got a really nice galley here. And these uh, doors and windows all slide open. So the galley is connected with your cockpit area there. See so a nice gas range with uh, five burners, oven below that. This one's set up uh, with the nicely appointed cooking setup here. And then you've got a, uh, looks like a convection microwave up top, dual basin sink and then storage below. Here in the island, you have your cold storage, top loading cold storage, as well as front loading cold storage. The table here has uh, fold out leaves and you'll note that is a high low table. So that can be uh, lowered down to the coffee table level or made into a full dining table. And then forward of this, here's your nav station with your Garmin electronics and your engine controls. So you can drive the vessel from uh, the lower helm. And then you've got a little U-shaped extension to the galley here with another little convenient sink. And here's the watertight door leading to the forward cockpit area. Okay, so up in the flybridge here, you're gonna see you've got a center line helm, which is really nice. You've got the uh, Fusion stereo there, Garmin Electronics, and your uh, Volvo engine controls, as well as your uh, bow thruster. You've got uh, some U-shaped seating on the port side, as well as a nice big hard top here. In the back, you've got uh, some day beds here that are across, nicely protected by the stainless steel. And then we've got uh, some solar and then our traveler system there. Very rigid hard top here. There's your access up to the boom. And on the starboard side, you've got your uh, summer kitchen. Oh, you weren't kidding. Wow. Okay, so you're entering the main salon. Okay, and then we're gonna head down on the uh, port side. So port side forward, you've got a thwart ship, semi walk around berth. And then forward of that, here's your head, electric toilet, separate shower. And then port side midship, we have another matching berth here. Hanging lockers on the side integrated storage. There's a dedicated ensuite here with a separate shower. There's a fold out table there. And then on the starboard side, Forward, this is your third stateroom with the island berth, ensuite head, and then midship, starboard, 
This is your uh, owner's suite here. Get a nice high-low TV and uh, big windows there. Integrated storage along. There's a little uh, makeup vanity or laptop storage. It's a nice seating next to the bed there. And then here, aft of that, you got some really big hanging lockers, integrated storage, and then on the inboard, additional hanging lockers. After that, here's where your uh, head is. So you get a outboard uh, dedicated shower, the big uh, hatch there, the electric toilet behind that. And then this is really great here because you've got your integrated sink, nice big uh, storage behind the mirrors, and then you have direct access to the cockpit area. So if you're swimming on this boat, you can uh, come straight here. So you've got the three guest staterooms, one master, and you do have a dedicated stateroom for a crew. And this is the entrance. So over on the port side, this is entrance to the crew quarters. And this cabin is actually fully outfitted. And trimmed out to the level of a guest stateroom. up from the crew quarters. And then walking around on the uh, port side. See we have our forward lounge here and the watertight door. And you've got uh, storage on either side. Those can probably be made into additional crew berth if you want. Your windlass is center line, nicely protected in that hatch. And then here you see you've got some molded steps leading down into the interior. the back we'll take another look at this uh, hydraulic platform here and then through your cockpit you get the l-shaped seating extremely large teak table across from that on the starboard side you have an ice maker a day bed a raised day bed as well as a settee here on the starboard side nice teak treads leading upstairs and then in the aft you've got uh, cold storage and you've got a plancha grill here as well as a wet bar really nice teak here and a nice rugged ladder to board the boat then in the back here you have additional storage which is nice in case you had things for your tender and then up above here that's where the uh, shade comes down On behalf of myself, Tony, and the rest of the team at Denison, thanks for checking out the Fontaine Peugeot Samana 59. If you're in the market,